Um, I've got a magic wand. I just wave the magic wand, and very quickly we just make batsmen. No, I'm, jo I'm joking. Look, these things take time, you know, and I cannot come into a new culture and suddenly just start to change things. So there's going to be a period where I have to watch the batsmen. We have to observe how they go about their things. Um, you know, everyone, every country goes through waves. So at the moment, in your guys' opinion, they're not doing as well as you'd like them to do in test match cricket. But that wave will come again. The ability that I see over the last few days in, in this camp and what I saw while we were away, there's no reason why we can't get better and better and better. But, you know, it's, uh, it's international cricket. You know, some teams are at the top of the world for one moment. Some teams are not where they'd like to be. So we'll ride the wave, but I've got to take my time to get to know the players and watch them for a bit of time. Right away, oh, I mean, first and foremost, like, fantastic kid you know, with an unbelievable work ethic and drive to be successful. But along with that, huge amount of skill, you know, huge amount of skill. So what is exciting about Ridoy is that he has such a high ceiling. You know, with the amount of skill that he has, you know, he has a very, very high ceiling. That is my belief. But at the end of the day, we play a game that is results driven. So between the group, all the support staff, you know, our job is to make sure that he can maximise that potential. But from what we've seen already, very exciting. World Cup. In the World Cup? Yeah. Oh, I mean, what is every country looking for in a World Cup? Yeah. You know, I don't think we are any different. You know, we are very ambitious. This group, the Bangladesh Cricket Board, the players, we're, we're hugely ambitious. You know, we want to go to a World Cup and we want to do ourselves proud. You know, what the World Cup throws at you, who knows? But... You know, we can't worry about things that are out of our control. We've got to prepare ourselves as well as possible and, um, you know, do our research on the opposition and go and give of our best. That, that's all you can do at a World Cup. I mean, we've seen World Cups whether in any sport where people try and have a guess at who's in form, who's not in form, who's going to do well, and they always throw up surprises. So let's worry about our own house, and I'm sure we'll be okay. The, the challenge is what every single nation will face as a challenge against uh, against Afghanistan you know they've got a top spin attack so um, you know I think that the challenge is exciting you know it's it's exciting to be in that position where we have to go and solve that problem but having said that before you get through to the to the spin you still got to play the scene so we can't focus all our attention on on spin and then before we know it we five down again scene so we will obviously do our analysis we'll obviously do our research and um, you know come the time you know, playing test match cricket is like a game of chess. We've got to make sure that uh, whatever they bring, we have to provide solutions for. But it's exciting. It's exciting.